Welcome to session five. We're embarking on the last two sessions to finish. This is my story. And we kind of take a turn here. The first four sessions have allowed us to take time to think about our interaction and our trust and relationship with God. It's, if you was kind of been on, the focus has been on us understanding and receiving God's unconditional love. Session five in chapter six, turn. And now that we have begun to understand our own story, now I want us to move to thinking about sharing our story with other people. That's why it's entitled, Sharing My Story. Let's read the scripture for today. 2 Corinthians chapter 5, verses 17 through 19. Therefore, if anyone is in Christ, the new creation has come. The old has gone, the new is here. All this is from God, who reconciled us to himself, through Christ and gave us the ministry of reconciliation. That God was reconciling the world to himself in Christ, not counting people's sins against them. And he has committed us the message of reconciliation. Our first purpose in life is to understand that God created us, God loves us with an unfailing love, and that God's greatest desire above all else in our life is that we come to know that and we come into an intimate personal relationship with God, that we accept God's death on the cross, Jesus dying on the cross in our place. Jesus' life instead of my life. Once we come to understand that our first purpose is to know God's love, the second purpose, the remainder of our life, God desires that we share God's love with other people. We did this in one of the sessions, right? You thought about the people in your life that had helped you come to know God and the different experiences that God allowed to bring you into that relationship. Just as God used other people to help you, now God wants to use you to help other people. That's why... It's important to not only live the life that God has given us, enjoy our family and our friends, do use the gifts that we have that God has given us, but over all of that, it's to understand that God has given us all of those things and opportunities so we can share that God loves this person or that person. I remember when it happened to me, I worked with my dad for many years. Neither my dad or myself were a Christian. And I came to know Christ as I shared with you at age 34. Not long after that, I had a deep desire for my dad to know God's love. My dad had been searching for God's love for his entire life, but hadn't found it. It was a burden on my heart. I wanted to spend eternity with my dad. So I prayed and I prayed, God help me to share my story. What's happened to me with my dad? So as you work through this section, think about other people that are on your heart that you desire to know God's love. It'll be a great blessing opening yourself up to be used by Almighty God 
God will open doors that you've never, ever imagined could be open. God loves you. God bless you. Enjoy session five.